And honestly, be careful. There's so many fakes of these out there right now. I'm actually thinking about backing out on them. What is good, Divers family? We're back with another video. As you guys seen on that last video, we did a few buyouts, and most importantly, we finally brought back the Free Find Friday. Super excited about that. If you wanna get involved in the Free Find Friday, make sure you check out this video here. But for now, we're gonna to try to get some things done in the shop, of course, knock out some buyouts, and talk to you guys about our new clothing rack that's gonna be happening soon. Let's jump into this video. Shout out to boy Nissan, came by and did a trade for his Father's Day grills right here. Jeez. Hey, Father's Day, baby. Better than the Grinches or not? I say they are better than the Grinches because the storyline behind it, honestly. Right. It's real more of a collectible item for me. This is that sentimental value. Thank you, Diverso, for making it happen. Yes, yes sir. Jeez. I'm actually thinking about backing out on this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what was the trade? DS, Military Blacks, one of our do all time favorites. Holy Grail. So, like 200 value. And then you bought a pair of black hats. Super clean, size 11 and a half. And honestly, be careful. There's so many fakes of these out there right now. Like, you, you really, it's so hard to freaking tell. It's just in an all black shoe, it's super hard to tell. Make sure you guys are looking at these, doing your research. Oh, How much are you thinking for these, bro? Uh, I wanted like four, bro. I ain't gonna lie, I want four hundred. A little bit more, but I'm trying to be, you know, I ain't trying to go all crazy with it. I haven't seen these. They're like 600 right now on eBay. Uh, I said eBay, uh, fucking stock eggs. It's a woman's shoe. Yeah, the market's kind of weird on it. Brand new, too? Yeah, they're brand new. Let me look these up too, man. That's a size, what is that? Eight. Eight. Size eight, too? Yep. Let me know. Man, let me know what's the all there. Just because I see like the other like half size going up one and the down one, the smaller ones, they're only going for like 150 new. I know the nine half on this one, because someone's asking five, but it is hard when like to price it at a, over like that price because someone could just go half size up and literally buy it for 172. Oh, I get, or I, down and go. I get what he's saying. You know what I mean? My offer would just be pretty far, bro. To be honest, it'd be far off. What would your offer be? It's only like 50 bucks, 60 bucks, yeah. I only put it for like 120, 140, so. Yeah, that's cool, bro. These are both ready? Uh, the Yeezys I wore once. How much are you thinking for these, bro? I was trying to get 180. Um, see the max we do is like 100 on these, bro. I don't know. Yeah, we we'll probably sell them for that 180. 130. That's cool. We got that. Like All right, we picked up some size eight Celtic or classic green dunks. Picked them up for one thirty. Super clean, probably worn once. You trying to sell them? Yeah. How much are you thinking on these, bro? Yeah, I paid two twenty retail. Two twenty. Can you do two? Man, thank you. I was just trying to do retail just to get my money back. For that two twenty? Yeah. That's cool, bro. Two twenty. Damn. I think they're both dope. Kobe Should we show them or not yet? Not yet. Not yet. Definitely yeah, not yet. Yeah, right there, we got like two different mock-ups. Super excited. This, this guy saw it here first. Yeah. Hey, if you want the leaks, let me know. <laughs> he says he's a botter, bro. But oh, he probably is. Yeah. Well, you didn't yeah. believe him or what? I don't know, bro. <laughs> Wait, what'd you trade for these? The Onyx. The Onyx. That's not bad, actually. Yeah, that so, isn't bad. This is more retail than the Form Runner. Yeah. Uh, well, I paid 90 bucks for these, pretty much. And it's like 220, no? Yeah. I'm telling you, bro. Now you can do get these guys. Yeah, the <laughs> stock actually go like 80, 100. Nice. Forget how much I pay for them. 20, 30 bucks. 15 bucks. 50. 50, bro. No way. Yeah. This man been a thrifter before thrift was a That's thing, awesome. bro. Freaking. Thrift, the thrift, his face will pop up. Man, we're having some super technical difficulties with this freaking wall. Can't no wait. <laughs> Look at all his clothes, right? But yeah, we, I literally just came into it in the. Things were off on my tank. Well, we're gonna redo it. We're trying to get it like in something like this. So it has more support on the bottom and this doesn't happen anymore. Yeah, because this wall, as you can see, we've been trying to do like hella repairs. Just, this is on me right here. And like yeah. the there's like the drywall is just it just ain't sturdy enough. And because you know what I think it is too? The basketball. Oh, that is true. When the impact uh, too many who bricks. comes in here in bricks? Uh, uh, Chino, Mikey, maybe. Chino, everyone, yeah. But Wait. Yeah, hopefully uh, we could get this done within the week. It'll look a lot nicer, I think. 
Got no, Bob the Builder over here. What do you have in your backpack? You have candies? <laughs> Yo, bro, look at me getting sturdy. It's inside. Inside? We're inside. Oh, cool. Subscribe to Naira Soul and make sure we get a meal. They call me Big Nate, Little Nate, Woo! Little Gus, Nathan. Look Nate. who we have here. And, we, and they call me Big Dog. <laughs> That's what we need to get from the Home Depot. We need four of these type of things and then it is. Just made a stop at Home Depot. Got pipes on deck. Finally getting some progress done. This is the frame right here that's gonna go on the ground. My hands are freaking dirty, so I'm not trying to hold the camera right. So these are the frame on the bottom. It's gonna go on the ground. It's gonna be a rack right here. Another rack up there. It's gonna go straight to the wall, and in the inside, you guys are gonna see what we're about to do. The new clothing rack. Still adding a little bit to it though. Got to patch up the holes and stuff, and then we're gonna have some floating shelves right here. We, All right, we finally got it up. We're feeling very confident on this one, the eyeball method. Eyeball method. Let's see if it works. Let's see if it's uh, straight. Let's see. That is perfect. Someone come look at this. All right, we're starting a new segment where we're gonna be giving away a super steal on either one or two videos out of the week. This one is now available for 50 bucks. You gotta be watching the promo code on the site is I Love Diverse. You spell out I Love Diverse, search up Jordan One Low Shatter Backboard, and these will be 50 bucks. Yeah, drop it 30, take it 510. What is it at? 510. So, 450. Even? Let's go. Even Stevens. All right, man, we finally got done with this new clothing rack here, our new setup. It was pretty hard to do. The hardest thing I think was just making sure these were like aligned because you could, you, the way you're twisting these poles, you get kind of all the threads, make sure they're all the same on the, each side. And they always turn out being different, but we finally got it down. We still plan on probably doing like a turf background and then maybe putting the TV right here. See. Little mirror right here so people can see views instead of walking all the way over here. Trying to bring in more uh, super clean and heat vintage for you guys. Uh, we're trying to organize it so it's easier for you guys to shop here. Hey. Alright guys, that is it for today's video. As you guys seen, we did a few buyouts and man, we finally knocked down the new clothing rack. We got the help of Joey and young Freddy in the camera. <laughs> we finally knocked it down. We ended up making it look like a $1,200 job. So whoever comes in, make sure you guys peep it. New clothing rack where all the new vintage stuff's gonna be at. And as we mentioned in our last video, if y'all been watching, we finally got the new mural in the works. So it's actually happening guys, stay tuned. Make sure your post notifications are on so you guys can stay up to date with it. Thank you guys for all the love we've been getting. Make sure you guys comment down below, leave your thoughts, make sure you guys like, and please don't forget to subscribe and share. We appreciate all the feedback. That's it, peace.